Yeezy Gap, engineered by Balenciaga, one of the most talked about collabs of the year, is finally here. Orders are shipping out and respective customers are starting to receive their first pieces. So what's going on guys? J.A. here in today's video, we're gonna go over first impressions of one of the most hyped collaborations of 2022. How's the quality? Sizing, is this overhyped or is it worth the long await? Stay tuned to find out. So they're describing this collaboration as demonstrating Ye and Demna's shared creative vision of utilitarian design in conjunction with Gap's casual silhouette. So here you have pictured the Yeezy Gap engineered by Balenciaga lookbook, which was shared by Kanye himself via Instagram with several different cool looks from the collection, uh, in my opinion. This joint definitely gives me like futuristic, gothic, biker type of vibes, which is cool because fashion is supposed to be fun. And I feel like this is definitely a look. So with that being said, you have the lookbook here. And then from the lookbook, this is the actual items that went up available for pre-order via the website. So it ranges from t-shirts to hoodies to even a denim jacket. So pretty much all of the collection has been delayed until later summer, but it looks like customers are starting to receive a couple of pieces, which include the 3 4th t-shirt as well as the um, Dove hoodie. So we have a range of customer reviews from YouTube to Reddit, but we even got a personal testimony from our man Chicken Strips from the JA Discord. So his review says that the shirt is mad comfy, heavy quality is amazing weight is about a pound and a half which is very good sturdy quality for a t-shirt he said the screen printing of the gap logo is just like the round jackets quality is on point and everything is amazing just like easy season apparel but it's very massive so you may ask how massive thus we have this image Courtesy of Reddit, pictured here you have the Yeezy Gap engineered by Balenciaga t-shirt. On top of it, you have a standard general size medium t-shirt. The catch is though, is that the black Yeezy Gap t-shirt under it is actually a size medium as well. Now shout out to Tyler Ayers who has also shared his initial review of the pieces via his YouTube channel. So I'll be sure to have a link to his video down below. And he happens to be a size medium as well. And from this clip, the size medium T appears to fit almost like an extra large. So the same could be said for the hoodie, which according to this Reddit poster, he is five foot seven. He normally goes with a size medium and he copped the hoodie in a size small, which you can clearly tell from this image that it still appears to have an oversized look. Now the difference between the hoodie and this three fourths T is that the waist area around the hoodie appears to be cropped, thus giving it kind of a different appearance. So I foresee a lot of people, one, either returning the items or two, selling them on the secondary market for a smaller size. So was everything in this collection made two sizes too big or was this the intended look for the vision? If you guys reference back to the lookbook, which we talked about earlier, you'll notice in this specific image right here that everything is fitted to a larger proportion. So in my opinion, the true intended look is that oversized look for the collection. So if you guys are interested in a more traditional fit, I would size down probably about two sizes at least for the t-shirt and the hoodie. We'll have to wait and see for the other items from the collection as they release later this summer. So I'm a big fan of the collection. I feel like it's very tasteful. I'm a fan of the washed look. I like how the Gap logo almost blends in with the top and I'm a huge fan of the Doug graphic on the back. Now I didn't order anything from the initial first collection, but if you guys see via Farfetch, there are an array of different new items coming soon, which range from tan to navy to red to even a white t-shirt as well as a hoodie. So I actually copped the 
tan no seam t-shirt from the pre-order in a size large. Now I'm a true to size XL, so I'm kind of nervous to see what it looks like when it comes in, but I'm just curious to know, did you guys cop anything from the initial first pre-order? Did you guys get anything from the Farfetch drop? And if you received any of your pieces, what are your first impressions? Do you guys feel like they were thrown off with the sizing or do you feel like this look was the intended oversized look for the Yeezy Gap engineered by Balenciaga collaboration? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below. We're gonna wrap up today's video here. I'm JA, stay safe, stay blessed, and I'm out y'all. Salute.